Welcome back, everyone. Professional bull riders will be competing this weekend in Atlantic City as they unleash the beast. Our news reporter Pat Gallon is live at PBR in South Philly, where he is going to unleash his beast. His words, not mine. So, Pat, are you ready? Uh, I think I'm ready. I don't know if I'm ready to become a professional bull rider, but we'll see. I'm ready to give it a shot okay. again up here on this thing. I'm joined by Sean Willingham. He is a professional bull rider. Sean, thanks for joining us this week, Welcome. Morning, yeah. So what's happening this weekend? What do you have going on? Uh, we have uh, one of our big events, uh, Unleash the Beast Tour in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Coming Happy. up Saturday and Sunday, uh, we have the top 35 bull riders in the world. We also bring in the top 35 bulls in the world as well. So not only is the best bull riders going to be there, but the best bulls in the whole world will be here as well. Now, I'm wearing, Sean, is this your actual gear that you're going to wear? That's my gear I wear when I, when I compete in the arena. Uh, you can see it's just a, a jacket and some chaps. And, you know, you don't have the full gear on, but that's what, I, that's what I ride with. We have a rope that we hold on with as well. And, you know, I ride with a helmet, which we're not going to do that for you today. But, <laughs> Because you got one. soft mat to land on, not the hard dirt and that's true. And live bull. How long have you been riding bulls for? I've been doing it for 19 years as a professional. That's a long time. Lots of uh, bruises <laughs> and bumps and scrapes. A, a lot of injuries. Uh, you know, I've cracked my skull to to breaking my ankle and legs and torn muscles and and all kinds of good stuff. That's why it is the toughest sport on dirt. Now you are from Georgia. You actually had your surgery here in Philly. I did. I come up here to one of the best doctors in the world and, and did my growing surgery here in Philadelphia. So one of the best doctors there is. He does a lot of high maintenance athletes yeah. and uh, you know, he did a good job. It, it took me a full year to recover, but uh, you're you know, back. now I'm back and firing on all cylinders. All right, beautiful. Atlantic City this weekend. Come see Sean and the top 35 in the world. Now you saw me ride this thing a little bit earlier. What were your initial thoughts on that? that it's, it's pretty good for a beginner. Uh, there's still some training we could do to make you a little better, but we're going to turn the bull up this time for you ah, and actually give you a, a little more intense of a ride. All right, great, great. All right, here we go. All right, what, what's the key then, Sean? It's to just kind of get up high and hold on for life? The key is to hold on for eight seconds. <laughs> eight seconds. Eight seconds. We eight may seconds. let you, uh, we're All just right. going to start it off probably and stay at the front. All right, here we go. All I need is eight seconds, Jim and Rahel. Okay, come on. Turn I'm up the speed. I'm not going to make eight seconds here. Oh, okay. Right. So, okay, Jimmy One Song Pony. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this song. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Pat. Yeah, Pat. Oh. Oh. Good effort. Was that eight? That was that. We're gonna go with. Uh, was that eight? We're gonna go with eight. We'll go with we're eight. We're gonna go with eight. It's like four and a half. What's going on there? Sean, thanks, man. Yes, good job. Appreciate okay. it. Pat, That's good eight job. seconds. Bravo, Looks Patrick. Good. And he's always such a good sport. Thank you. Thank you, Pat.